Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. Now, there are a few things that you want to keep in mind when getting a VPN. So I've chosen three of the best VPNs based on these particular factors. And before we get into it, you can check out the full reviews if you're interested, or if you're looking to go straight to the pricing or discounts, you'll find what you need in the description down below. Now, these factors will be the privacy policy, speed, streaming and torrenting capabilities, as well as features and whether or not they collect logs on you. Now, having tested over a couple of dozen VPNs, I've narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best overall. All these VPNs are fully compatible with streaming and torrenting. They have independently audited no logs policies, and they've been audited by companies like Pricewater House Coopers, Cure 53, and other auditing giants. They all fully support torrenting. You even have specialty peer to peer servers with NordVPN if this is something that you're interested in. And they all have the necessary security features, not to mention that nobody will be able to see what you're doing online, whether you're using Express. Nord or Surfshark, not your ISP, not your government or any other outside party. So again, they all have independently audited no logs policies. So that's proof that they don't collect information about their users and sell it to third party advertisers. They fully support streaming and torrenting without any restrictions. And I've tried Express Nord and Surfshark with Hulu, Netflix, Amazon, all kinds of Netflix libraries, in fact, and they've worked perfectly well without any inconsistencies. Although if one server seems to just not give you access to the service that you're looking for, just disconnect and reconnect to that same server, you'll pick up a new IP address and you'll be good to go from there. So when it comes to these VPNs, again, if you're looking for more info, you'll find them in the reviews below. But if I were to just make a quick recommendation on each VPN here, you can go with Express VPN if you're looking for something that is incredibly easy to use. And it's very quick. In fact, this VPN is the VPN that gets me to spend the least time operating it as opposed to all the other VPNs. So if you're looking for something that is perfect for a daily driver of a VPN, it's reliable, consistent, incredibly easy easy to use. Again, very quick to connect and disconnect, which is something I really like and appreciate. You've got 105 countries at your disposal, and you'll be able to secure up to eight devices per subscription. So if you're looking for the best overall VPN, Express is the way to go. Now, if you're looking for more of a well-rounded option that offers a whole bunch of bonus features for a very reasonable price, then NordVPN will be perfect choice, especially that it maintains very high levels of security and it's arguably the fastest VPN in the business thanks to the Nordlynx protocol. Not to mention that you've got 111 countries at your disposal and you'll be able to secure up to 10 devices per subscription. And again, a lot of bonus features that are explained in the review down below, but they can be very useful in a handful of situations. And if that's not enough and you're still looking for more simultaneous connections, for example, while well, you'll be able to share your account with as many friends and family members as you would like with Surfshark, since it allows for an unlimited number of simultaneous connections with just a single subscription. So this is a very budget-friendly option. In fact, it's the best budget VPN that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost without sacrificing any of the necessary features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs like Nord and Express. Not to mention that even if you go for the one plan with Surfshark, which is considered to be the higher tier plan for Surfshark, it will still cost less than NordVPN. But the difference is with Surfshark, you're not only getting a VPN, you're also getting a fully fledged antivirus as well as a bunch of other alert features and identity protection features that overall contribute to more security online. So if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, again, you'll find links to pricing discounts and reviews in the description down below. Now, before I go, if you do end up getting any of these VPNs, you probably want to know how long you're going to need it for, because a lot of people thinking they're not going to need the VPN for longer than a month end up spending more money on the monthly plans with the higher rate, as opposed to getting a subscription with a six month plan or a 12 month plan here, which will save you much more in the long term. So unless you know you're not going to need the VPN for more than a month, then go for something that saves you a little bit more in the long term, especially when using the discounts below. And that's not just for Express, that also applies to Nord and Surfshark. So feel free to take advantage of those while they last. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.